Hi guys, welcome to this week's video. Today we'll be showing you a little bit more in depth of what we do with custom fitting. This is Matthew, he is the operations manager at the Weald of Kent and a new member at Gillingham Golf Club. He's after some new irons, we'll have a little look, see what works best for him. We're going to start off by using the Mizuno DNA shaft analyzer, see what sort of shafts are going to work best in the clubs for him. As you can see from the overlays, an average of 86.3 miles an hour, with a tempo 6, toe down 3.67, kick angles 5.33, with a release sector as an even 4. Matthew's current shafts in his Callaways are the KBS Torque 120X, so we're going to have a, a little warm up, see how they perform, so we've got a direct comparison where we're trying the new shafts and new heads. Matthew's good ones are going around about the 160, um, but when the smash drops off, it doesn't quite hit it out the middle. We're looking more about the 150. So we've got an average of 153. So let's have a little look, see if we can get that smash up and a bit more consistent distance. Right, we've uh, tried a few different shafts. Uh, we shall go into that in a moment of what's been working. We'll just have a little double check of the lies and see what happens. As you can see from the tape, Matt's marking a little bit more towards the toe. The toe may well be digging in, but we're gonna try a little bit more upright, but my worry is that the mist may turn further left. Right, we're still a little bit towards the toe, so we're gonna have a little go with four degrees up. Right, tape wise, that's marking smack bang in the middle now. However, when we look at the direction of flight on the flight scope, we have turned in a bit more of a draw. So we're gonna go with two degrees upright. We're now gonna have a little look at grip size. The fingertips on the left hand should just about be touching the pad of the thumb. So theoretically, just like that. However, Matt prefers a slightly thicker grip. This feels more comfortable holding it, doesn't have to grip it so hard, and also fights that turning the hands over. Right, we've tried a few of the different shafts. Um, we've tried Project X, Project XLZ, and we've uh, came out with best was the uh, AMT White uh, from Dynamic Gold. This is an X100 shaft. It's a little bit lighter than the other, so Matt felt a bit more comfortable with that, and it certainly gave us the best results. It's a varying weight and mass technology shaft. It ranges from 106 grams in the long irons down to 130 grams in the shorter irons. It's a low launch, low torque shaft. As you see from the overlay, uh, we've uh, tried the T100 and the T100S. There wasn't a huge amount of difference between the two clubs. T100S is a couple of degrees stronger, so it has gone a little tiny bit longer, but not masses in it. But we are going to go for a four and a five iron in the T200 head, just to make a little bit more forgiveness in the longer irons. And the T100S blends perfectly with the set. Right guys, thanks for watching this week's video. Hope you enjoyed it. And you a few ideas of what we do down here in our fitting sessions. We've got lots of brands here that if you want to come and try it, we generally use a, an hour slot for an iron fitting. Obviously we've uh, glazed over it a little bit quicker for the video because you don't really want to be watching me for an hour. However, you would have to put up with me for a fitting if you did come.